A powerful M8 solar flare erupted on December 6th and sent a surge of energy straight toward Earth, hitting the upper atmosphere hard enough to trigger a sudden radio blackout across the Pacific. Signals below 20 megahertz vanished for almost 20 minutes as the ionization spike spread across the region. Forecasters were watching a different part of the sun and did not expect an eruption from this location. According to spaceweather.com, the blast was followed by a full halo CME aimed directly at Earth, with NASA models pointing to a December 9th impact. A storm in the G2 to G3 range is possible, strong enough to disturb power systems and push auroras deep into mid-latitudes, even with moonlight. The eruption originated from the wrong sunspot. The massive region that looked ready to explode stayed silent, while a smaller and less active sunspot unleashed the strongest flare of the day. That reversal has created real concern because it suggests the solar surface is behaving unpredictably and the visible patterns are no longer a reliable guide. As the CME moves closer, observers are watching for any follow-up eruption that could shift conditions before arrival. A second flare would change the impact scenario instantly. For now, attention is locked on the incoming cloud and the growing uncertainty about what the sun will do next.